everyone. So I've Hi. been seeing this thing at Whole Foods for a long time. It's called Sweet Tamarind. And it's going to be her first it's time. It's going to be my first time trying because my friend Ilka from Cape Verde, she was like, oh, Sweet Tamarind. I was like, what is that? I've never, ever had it. So I guess in Africa, she's from Cape Verde. Yeah, this is we like an old love home. this. We make juice out of it. We make what? ice cream You make out juice of out of this? How? Yeah, you, make a, you soak it in water and then you add sugar. So good, but I can't wait for her. So you peel the this skin off like this, like that. You it looks it. like a date, <laughs> but it tastes even better, and it's really rich in fiber, iron, and it also helps with weight. It looks management. like a shriveled up. I'm not gonna say. No, it. do not say it. <laughs> but it's so good. It's so tasty. Here, I'm not gonna say. But don't you know, swallow the seed. You can suck, I watch you eat it first? You suck it, you suck it, and you take off the seed. I yeah, have to first. say, it doesn't look very appetizing. Mm. That's really good. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can have my own. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, I got this from Whole Foods. Well, she got it because it's her food that mm. she likes from her country. But mm -hmm. okay, so how do you eat it? Oops. Break them. Mm. All right, so I break it. Mm. How do you call it in Cape Verde? What do you call? What do you? Say? This is African Skittles. <laughs> You it's call so it African good. Skittles? No, I just made that up. It tastes like Skittles? <laughs> it's better than Skittles. Okay, so this, this is, is healthy. It looks like a it bean. It even helps you lose weight. It looks like a bean pod. Mm. Okay? Well, it's like a bean pod kind of. I would never buy this. I mean, I see it all the time. It just doesn't look very appetizing. I mean, I'm mm. all for trying new fruits. It's so good, you guys. I'm actually... She's hilarious. I'm actually very adventurous when it comes to food. I'll try something new, but I just didn't. Okay, so this is me for the first time trying this. Suck the seed off. Okay, first of all, there's not much fruit here. <laughs> there's nothing to it. It is a bunch of seeds. Bum. It's rich in iron. Here are the seeds. Fiber. You can tell it's rich in iron because it's the color of iron. Vitamin C. Whenever you really see that it. color, you know food's rich in iron. I like it. Mm -hmm. It's got like a sour aftertaste, which I love sour and sweet. Mm -hmm. mm. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. It's one of my favorite fruits. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. It's addictive. It's kind uh -huh. of like a, a, a quiet taste. Once you start eating it, you can't stop. Well, according to this box, it's from Thailand. But yeah, but they from, have it in Africa. People from Cape Verde eat it. You mm -hmm. know what's funny? Every time I have African foods, friends who are like, oh, this food is indigenous to Africa. Seven grams. You'll look, at, you'll look it up in, in Google and it'll tell you it's from another country. Look, right here? No, this is African. racism. This is African. So it's mm. seven grams of fiber, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. three grams of protein. It's kind of high in sugar, 52 grams of sugar, but it's all natural. It has 4%, um, it's um, 64 milligrams of calcium, 4% calcium, 4% uh, iron, 25% mm -hmm. potassium. Most of it ends up in the garbage. <laughs> Most of it is the skin. I mean, I like it. She's right. It is addictive because I just want more. Yeah. You, it's like you can't stop. I just want more, but it's not like just some tasty thing like a pineapple or something. It's no, just it's like... not a pineapple. It's a tamarind. <laughs> it be a pineapple. I mean, to me, like a pineapple is extremely delicious. Yeah, but it's but like... It's a pineapple. This is like... This is like... It looks like a bean pod. I mean, but am I going to act... Would I ever pod. buy this? On my own. Now. I do. I will. Do. I will always. I understand the power of growing up eating something. Like, like there are certain things I grew up eating because I'm Haitian. And I'm like, this is heaven on earth. And my friends are like, okay. I mean, I like it. I have to admit. I like the taste. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, good. You can watch TV and eat this. <laughs> you mm -hmm. go for a walk and eat this. Look at the seeds. I wish I could do something with the seeds. Yeah, you can. What? Plant it. Have a tamarind tree. Those trees are huge, though. You need a lot of land. Oh, really? They're like old trees? Mm-hmm. I like it. But am I going to buy this? No. But the ones in Africa are more sour, evidently. Uh, the tamarind. 
in Africa is way more sour. Mm. It's almost like eating sour candy, it's, but it's so sour that you can't put a whole pot in your mouth. You have to eat one, each, each one separately. Because if you put a whole pot in your mouth, it's going to be too sour and uh, your mm. face will turn red and <laughs> <laughs> it won't work. These are the seeds. I mean, it's growing on me. But this... To be honest, I could eat the whole box. Mm-hmm. I could. Mm-hmm. It's like an acquired taste. I could eat a little. So for the first time eating it, seeing that rich red color, which whenever I see that color, I know that something is good in iron. There's like a specific red. I call it iron red. Mm -hmm. Iron red like this or like rooibos. Mm -hmm. You guys know rooibos tea? Rooibos has that same color. Mm -hmm. I call it the iron color. And when you see red dirt in Haiti, we have this red dirt. It's that color. And you know that soil is rich in iron. So... So that's so funny, you know, nature's language. What is it called? Uh, the doctrine of signatures. Mm -hmm. How nature tells you, like, what's in what. Yeah, but the African one, like I said earlier, is a lot more sour than like the one in Thailand. The Thailand, the Thailand mm -hmm. one is sweeter. But the, one, the thing about the one, the tamarind from Africa, you won't be able to eat as many. Because mm. it's too sour. Sour, sour, sour. So for people that are like sour fruit, like people that like sour uh, lovers, tamarind from Africa will be like the most sour fruit you will ever encounter in your life. Mm. So good. On the box, it says we harvest tamarind from managed farms. So this is not wild grown, which do not destroy the natural flora and fauna. Okay. I don't know. I like it. We don't know what it means, but it tastes good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I could do a whole box. Yeah, she can. At first, she was like, mm, I don't know. <laughs> but then she's like, oh, I actually like it. I was mm -hmm. like, why didn't you say that on the video? I do like it. But you know what's funny? I love fruits with seeds. You know, in America, they got, they got rid of all the seeds. Like, you can't find grapes with seeds. You can't find anything with seeds. Even lemons now, they're, like, getting rid of seeds. But mm -hmm. oh, all of our old fruits have tons of seeds. Like, when I grew up, watermelons, oh, my God, like... We would have a cup full of seeds if we had one watermelon. But so whenever I see fruits with seeds, it gives me great joy. <laughs> it gives you hope. Mm -hmm. It gives me hope. Because I remember when I was in fourth grade or third grade, my teacher was like, a fruit is an enlarged ovary with seeds. Mm. And they were like, so she was like, avocados are fruits. Tomatoes are also fruits. Mm -hmm. um, so, so in my mind... Fruits and seeds go hand in hand. They sure do. Mm -hmm. Okay, I like tamarind. Would I ever buy this myself? If I go over, go over to Ilka's house and she has a box, I'll eat the whole box. She will tear it up. But am I going to buy this? No. She will. She's going to call me a tamarind. Are they that addictive? I went to Whole Foods and I bought some tamarind. That's what she's going to say. It's like a date. But better. Yeah, because it has the sour. Dates are like sweet with no sour. Mm. It's the perfect combination of sweet and sour. Mm. Mm. Another thing, you can actually buy them at Whole Foods. And the price is actually cheaper than the other stores that I've encountered tamarind up. Like, really? Ralph's, Ralph's has it more expensive. Uh, Whole Foods was only $4. Really? Mm-hmm. Well, that's also because... You know, Jeff Bezos, Amazon bought Whole Foods, so now all Whole Foods foods are a little bit cheaper that I also noticed. And I, you know, I let them track me with their little tracking device, which helps me <laughs> save money. Uh, okay, we're still eating. Okay, this box is almost over. She said she's okay, but... Me and her, we've been going through pods after pods mm -hmm. after pods. This is this box is almost over. Oh, it's on. We didn't even like the we didn't even finish this video in the box. How many servings is in a box? Six pods. It's two point five servings. So we're two people. So I guess. I don't know. We tore it up. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. I hope you okay. find some tamarind. So here's the conclusion. I do like it. I like it. Here's the box. 
I like it. I want to try the African one though that you were talking about. Because this one's from Thailand. Mm -hmm. yeah. I like it. My conclusion is I like it. Would I buy it? No. Yes. <laughs> she's going to buy it and she's going to call me. Hey, Oka. I went to Whole Foods and I found It's kind of messy. Like you guys can't see the mess. Can I show them this mess? Let me show you the mess. One second. Yeah, I'm just cleaning the floor. Oh, I don't want you guys to see my whole house. Yeah. It's my business. Mind your business. But mm -hmm. it like it, you have to like leave the seeds and the the whole thing. It's like messy. Mm -hmm. But but it's one from. I like it. I like it, but I'm not buying it again. I like it. I love it. She loves it. She's the one that was like she knew what it was. So I was like, oh, I see this stuff all the time, and I'm so experimental. There's so many fruits that I bought living in the states that I didn't grow up eating. But for this, some reason, I was like, what is this? And how do you eat it? And when I saw how little fruit you're really getting, I'm like, come on. But I'm glad I got it. Thanks, Ilka, for introducing me and, you know, getting me cultured. And now I, for the first time in my life, tried tamarind. I like it. It's tasty. <laughs> Ta-ta. Say bye to everybody. Ciao. Ciao. Mwah.